We're getting answers to frequently asked questions today from Colin. He's the Motor and Drive Product Manager here at Malloy. Which one are we talking about today? Today we're going to talk about ABB's ACS 355 drive. So we sell quite a few of these and a lot of guys are going to want to set these out in the field by themselves. So we try and want to help them walk through it. So Absolutely. What are we going to show them first? Today we're going to uh, go through the motor uh, data parameters. So uh, in every one of these drives we've got to set up the motor data. So um, this is one of the frequently asked questions that I get. What do we do? So we're going to go in here into the menu. We're going to select parameters. Then we're going to go up to the 99 group, which is always motor data in every ABB drive. At that point, we're going to go down to 9904, which is the control mode. So we select scalar. It's a simpler form. In advanced applications, we try and select vector. Um, at that point, we'll scroll down to 9905, which in this case, it's 230 volt. Um, then 9906, which is the motor's current. And we've got to input exactly what's on the nameplate. In this case, 1.4 amps. Uh, the frequency, 60 hertz. Uh, 9908, which is the nameplate speed of the motor. If it says, if you think it's an 1800 RPM motor and it says 1745, put 1745 in. And then finally, the horsepower of the motor. In this case, it was a 0.3 kW motor, so we put 0.3 kW in. And then they're good to go. And they're good to go. And if they're still confused, they can call you, right? Yes, All absolutely. Right. We got the number right there on the screen. Thanks, Colin. Thanks. And thanks for spending a minute with Malloy.